All right, so the one, first off, want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahasim, Yahweh Shah. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And it's a sincere salawam to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and in sincerity. I want to go on this lesson. I'm going I'm to uh, title it, Boaz Do Not Want Your Hoaz. Okay? Um, which a lot of women, they claim that, that they want a man of the Lord. Okay, and and they equate you know uh, Boaz to to being a man of the Lord, and they you know they always say I'm waiting for my Boaz or whatever. You know they want a God fearing man, but these women, you know they don't fear the Most High, uh, Yahweh or His Son Yahweh Shah. You know the world ignorantly calls Jesus. You know they don't fear the Most High. And uh, they don't keep his commandments, okay? Um, this world is so upside down, man, okay? And this lesson is not um, to uh, necessarily ridicule someone, okay? I'm not. It's not no personal attack, but uh, if the shoe fit, wear it, you know, and repent. Uh, because a man of the, the Lord, uh, he's going to want a virtuous woman, man. Boaz wants a virtuous woman, okay? And what we see in this society is so far beyond uh, virtuous, okay? It's anything but, okay? This is Proverbs 31 and 9. It says, open thy mouth, judge righteously, okay? And what, you know, this video, I'm... I'm you know, Lord willing, you know, the Lord put the spirit on me to bring out certain points, okay? On um, what a virtuous woman is, okay, and how these women are nowadays, okay? I'm just go with the spirit, okay? And, and and say what the scriptures say, okay, and 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 what this world um the the state that these women are in this world, okay? That's uh you know based off of uh, proper judgment or righteous judgment okay it says and plead the cause of the poor and needy okay and when you look at the state or the condition that um, a lot of so-called black women which they're mostly the ones who always say this you know that they want a, a Boaz okay which Boaz is an Israelite by the way okay um, the poor and needy okay now you have a lot of women that are in a section eight type of um environment on food stamps and stuff like that okay and most of the times when um you're on uh section eight or even have a a, a, a man on child support that's what a lot of women do okay most of the times these women that are in these section eight houses they're women that have children okay and they're not with their original uh, man that is still living okay it says who can find a virtuous woman you know this is a question it says who can find a virtuous woman for her her price is far above rubies okay now um going to the word um virtuous which is in the hebrew Kayal, Kayal, okay? It says strength, might, efficiency, wealth, army, ability, efficiency, wealth, force, army, okay? And when you're going to um, efficient, okay? Um, well, the word virtuous means righteous, you know, for the most part. But then, okay, a lot of women aren't righteous. A lot of women aren't self-efficient, okay? Um, don't know how to, uh, you know, cook, clean, okay, always complaining and so on and so forth, okay. Um, it says the heart of her husband doth do or doth safely trust in her, okay. And when you look at the way um women are nowadays, you can't trust these women, man. Further than you could throw them, like 
it's it's bad enough that you know women back then in 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 uh, biblical days, okay, um, they had more sense than than women nowadays do, okay. Women walk around like they don't have any sense whatsoever, and 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 you can't trust these women with with, with money with 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 anything with your children with 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 allowing you to be a man, okay. It says so that he had so have no need of spoil. Okay? It says she will do him good and not evil all the days of her life. And to be honest, man, like most guys, you know, the 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 they not they're not gonna allow a a, a good woman to go. Okay? If a woman is, is doing something that a, a man, you know, if, if she's doing what she's supposed to for her man, a, a man really not going to let her go, okay? But when you look at the situation nowadays of how this society uh, tries to put women on a pedestal and tries to say that they're queens when women don't even know the, the meaning of, of a queen, okay? You know, they, they want to sit up there and say they want a Boaz but then call themselves queen, okay? And this is the etymology of of the word queen okay it says uh queen as you can see and then when you go down um it says uh, uh source queen okay so you go into this word okay and it says uh, a young robust woman female surf hussy prostitute okay so a lot of these women okay and it also says public women you know a lot of these women like going to the clubs and you know partying and and, and bullshitting and stuff like that okay got uh many bodies on them and stuff like that have sex with a lot of guys you know different guys and they want to sit up there and see that they waiting for a righteous man of the lord okay when no man wants that type of stuff y'all women think that they're equal to men you know that's the way that this society paints that picture you know uh women uh think that men are supposed to you know be their servants and kiss their ass and stuff like that man okay when that's not how uh it's supposed to be and when you're going to the word well uh the book of ruth okay um you'll if if you you can read that you know you'll see how ruth uh went about trying to get uh boaz okay women nowadays they want guys to to, to chase them and you know the, the they want to play these guys but you know they want to talk to this guy but also have another guy around and you know it's just so much confusing man you know it says she seeks wool and flax and w works willingly with her hands you know being self-sufficient man if 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 something uh was torn or ripped on your guy's clothes you know women don't even know how to, how to fix that man you know it says she is like the merchant ships she brings her food from afar women don't know how to cook different different dishes and stuff like that you know it said it, women don't even know you ask these women like what what do you uh, know about organic uh products you know they don't know anything you know what do you know about um natural uh cures natural remedies and stuff like that you know they 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 send you to to a pharmacy or something man you know it says uh she she brings food from afar she rises also while it is yet night you know so in the middle of the night it says and gives meat to her household women don't even want to cook cook anymore now man you know they will you're a boaz you know you a boaz you need to be cooking for me you know, some that type of shit. Rather than being in submission to their man. You know? Uh listen and following what their man say. You know, rather go to these churches, which the churches is, is completely out of order, okay? The, the the Lord ain't dealing with these uh churches, man, your Sunday schools and all that stuff, man. The Lord is dealing with Israelites, man. Okay? According to the scriptures. Okay, it says, and gives meat to her household. And a portion to her maidens. She considers a field and buys it with the fruit of her hand. She plants a vineyard. Okay, and women don't know how to do that, man. 
It says she girds her loins with strength and strengthens her arms. She perceives that her merchandise is good. Her candles go out not by night. She lays her hand to the spindle and her hands hold the distaff. She stretch out her hand to the poor. Yes, she reach forth her hands to the needy. She is not afraid of the snow up for her household, for all her household are cloth with scarlet. You know, women don't, don't, you know, these women nowadays don't even be having coats for their children, man. You know, when it's cold out here, man. You know, it says she makes herself coverings of tapestry. Her clothing is silk and, is silk and purple. Her husband is known in the gates when he sits among the elders of the land. Okay. And, you know, this is just going in on, on, on the women, man. Okay. It says she makes of fine linen and sells it. You know, it says, and delivers girdles unto the merchant. Strength and honor of are her clothing. You know, like women don't know how to, um, like as, as, as I was saying, don't know how to be uh, submissive, man. You know, um, it's, you have women, certain women out here that are trying, you know, that are trying to do right by the Lord, you know, and, 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 and are in order. You know, they understand the order of things, you know, but the point of this lesson is that these women that say that they want a man of the Lord, they're not doing these things with the scriptures say, okay? They're not even trying to. They're not even looking for a man to guide them, okay? Onto the path of 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 Yahweh Shem Yahushua, you know. It says, "And shall rejoice in in time to come." She opens her mouth with wisdom, and then her tongue is the law of kindness. Okay, you ask these women, you know, do you eat pork, crabs, or shrimp? They, heck, especially these women in Baltimore, they love that man. You know, the uh, the crabs is like the logo for for the mo the mascot for for Baltimore, man. Okay. You know, you, 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 you try to have a, a, a decent conversation with these women. You can't even do that, man. You know, um, it says she looks uh, well to the ways of her household and eats not the bread of idleness. Her children arise up and call her blessed, her husband also, and he praises her. And one thing that um, that that we have to realize is that um we are under the curses according to the scriptures you know deuteronomy 28 you know uh 15 through 68 okay we're under the curses and um one of the reasons why uh women aren't like this you know is because they got turned against us you know this is just the way that that things was uh how things was meant okay i'm gonna go jump down to the 30th verse i mean and i'm gonna uh, go go on to the other scriptures it says favor is deceitful and beauty is vain, which a lot of these women, you know, they look at, you know, how they look and they think that, oh, I can get any man that I want. You know, and that, them looks that, that you have can easily get taken away, man. You know, it says, but a woman that fears the Lord, which is the the, the, the title of the lesson, you know, is, is, is it says, Boaz is, it, don't want your whole ass, okay? You know, and these women want a man that fears the Lord, but they don't fear the Lord. It says, but a woman that fears the Lord, she shall be praised. You know, a woman that has reverence, respect for Yahweh, and knowing that the Lord set in order, those are the women that need to be praised. Okay, not the woman with their asses out, you know, sitting up there trying to think that they could get a man just because they look good. Okay, or because they, they, they got degrees and stuff like that, man. You know. The, the the those women don't ain't ain't, ain't uh, special not not whatsoever man okay um this is uh Ruth the book of Ruth okay which you know they is is uh the the title of the lesson say you know these women went went a man of you know that that's similar to Boaz okay um which it says, uh, Ruth 2 and 1, it says, And Naomi had a kinsman of her husband's, a mighty man of wealth. So they want men that's, that's mighty, strong, have, you know, uh, a thousand pack, you know, 
uh, fit, you have the money and all that stuff. It says, of, of the family of Elimelech, and his name was Boaz, okay? But uh, let's see what Boaz said, okay? This is Ruth 2 and 11. And Boaz answered and said unto her, It has fully been sold me all that thou hast done unto thy mother-in-law since the death of thine husband. And now, and how thou hast left thy father and thy mother in the land of thy na na nativity, and art come unto a people which thou knewest not heretofore. You know, a lot of these women like being in the hood and, you know, it's just sloppy, man. It says, the, the Lord recompense thy work and a full reward be given you of the Lord God of Israel, okay, which, you know, the Israelites, under whose wings thou art come to trust. Then she said, let me find favor, favor in thy sight, my Lord. You know, so Ruth called Boaz her, her Lord. You know, Ruth was, was in order. She was trying to, you know, get uh, Boaz, okay? She called him Lord. How many women you know nowadays are going to call that man Lord? Now, you do have a lot of... Uh, uh, men out here that aren't right, you know, that 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 um, are wicked, but they're not they're not men of the Lord, man. Heck, you even got men that 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 claim to, to to be Israelites and stuff like that. But the thing is, you know, these women, you know, they as the scripture said, a woman that fears the Lord, she shall be praised. You know, women don't even fear y'all by Shemiah Shah, man. Okay, they don't even know y'all but some y'all side. They think that the most high name is God and his and his son name is Jesus, man. Okay? It says, um, my Lord, which she called him my Lord, you know, for thou for that thou hast comforted me, and for that thou hast spoken friendly of thine handmaid, though I be not like one on um white of your handmaids. Okay? Next verse it says, um, uh, Ruth three and eleven. And now, my daughter, fear not, I will do to you all that thou requirest. For all the city of my people doth know that thou art a virtuous woman. And and when you go into these different cities, man, and you 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 get the scoop in on, you know, these women in the past that they have, man, you 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 don't want to get them skeletons out that closet. You know, because these women nowadays be having skeletons in that closet. It ain't to say that. Uh, a, a person cannot change, you know, but the 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 thing is that you know women don't have that reverence, that respect, you know, not only for themselves, okay, but but for the real men of the Lord, okay, and that this society just teaches women that, you know, it teaches women that to 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 not res uh, respect men, okay, or or respect their men, you know, thinking that that men and women are equal. When, when that's not uh, true according to the scriptures. Um, Ecclesiastes 7 and 27. Behold, this have I found, saith the preacher, counting one by one to find the account which my soul, yet, I mean, which yet my soul seeketh, but I find not. One man among a thousand have I found, but a woman among all those thousand have I not found. Okay? So the scriptures are saying that the Lord found... You know, what well, Solomon, okay, was saying that, you know, uh, he found a man out of a thousand, okay? But a, a, as far as a woman of a thousand, he couldn't find one, you know? And these women are sitting up there making it seem like they're worth, um, you know, a, a, a man of the Lord, like like Boaz, but they're not, you know? Um, Romans 12 and 2 it says, and be ye not conformed to this world. You know, a lot of women love this world. And and, and um, this world is, is completely wicked. You know, they're not, uh, a lot of these women have uh, gay uh, best friends, you know. Um, homosexual uh, um, friends, you know, male friends or whatever. Um, heck, they're free, they're, 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 uh, people could be uh, faggots or something like that, you know homosexuals as to say okay it says be not comp conformed to this world you know uh smoking and, and all type of stuff man you know loving the ways of of america and and this society you know our women are just 
molded into this society okay and 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 a lot of us you know did have rough upbringings and stuff like that you know it says but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind and you're not going to get no boaz okay no man of the lord if you don't transform your mind okay now let me see what this word transform says it says be ye transformed okay it says to change to another form to change to transfigure uh yahweh's appearance was changed and was changed and resplendent with divine brightness on the mount of transfiguration so you have to change your mind into something that you know you 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 wasn't doing before you know not wearing pants following the law statutes and commandments to the best of your ability you know praying okay um serving your your man you know being in submission to your man okay and that's when you you'll be able to be, be saved man listening to a real man of the lord okay and 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 um i'm gonna keep going it says that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of god okay and a lot of people aren't proving what is the good, the acceptable, and perfect will of Yahweh by Simi Yahweh Except for the men, you know? And, and, um, hold on, I'm going to get this scripture. The, the, the men of the Lord, okay, as this scripture, um, says, uh, so, so if you was to find the Boaz right now, okay, that Boaz guy is going to be on a different type of level of thinking than what you you're, you're used to. Okay, First Corinthians seven and twenty twenty uh, seven. It says, "Are thou bound unto a wife? Seek not to be loosed." Okay, so you know you you find you if you have a if you have a woman, you know don't seek to be loosed from your woman. You know it says, "Art thou loosed from a wife? Seek not a wife." So a Boaz, you know, is it going to be seeking a wife? Right? Why? It says, 1 Corinthians 7 and 29. Uh, oh, I, I, I could go on this verse. It says, but, and if thou marry, thou hast not sinned. And if a virgin marry, and she, she has not sinned, nevertheless, she so, such shall have trouble in the flesh, but I spare you. Okay, so it's not a, a sin, you know, to, 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 you know, deal with somebody in this day and age, but... You know, the way that these people mentalities are, the way these people's spirits are, you know, it's best to stay away from it, okay? But here goes the, the, the scripture, the last point, okay? 1 Corinthians 7 and 29, but this I say, brethren, the time is short, okay? And we see, you know, right now how messed up things are, okay? We have the RFID chip, which a lot of these women that say they want a Boaz type of guy, you know, um, they're going to be accepting these chips, okay? Because they're not women of the Lord, you know. The Lord is going to destroy a lot of our people. The Bible says two thirds of our people are going to die, okay. And 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 a lot of those people that are going to die are women, okay. Um, that aren't living right, okay. You have a lot of these niggas that ain't living right too. They're going to get what they deserve. But that's not the point of this topic. It says it remains that both they that have wives be as though they had had none. Okay, because this 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 time is short. You know, Boaz is going to be devoted unto Yahweh by Shem Yahweh the Lord. You know, this is what you know the is the, the 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 our main focus is men of the Lord. Okay, that ain't to say if somebody comes around and you know they're a decent woman that you know we ain't going to deal with them, especially if they you know proven their self that they're uh, worthy. Okay, but at the same time, our mindset is getting the hell up out of here because we're not trying to build up no society or, 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 or build families in this society, okay? Because this place is about to get destroyed, okay? And, and, and a Boaz type of man is not going to be sitting up here playing games, you know, all lovey-dovey going on, on, on vacations and stuff like that with women. You know, he got, he going to have work to do. You know, he going to be devoted on to doing his work. Okay. So with that, man, you know, hopefully this lesson was um, edifying. You know, if if you want a Boaz type of man, 
You can't be uh, living in, in contradiction or contrary to what the scriptures say. Okay? Because men of the Lord do not want uh, uh, women that are conformed to the ways of this world. Okay? But with that, I want to say, Shalom.